What's going on everybody? King of Dragons 5000 here coming at you with another video update. Sorry I have not been uploading videos as frequently as I want to. I really haven't seen anything in stores that I want to pick up and that I want to show off to you guys. It's just stuff that I can pick up at any time. It's nothing too special. But another reason I haven't been picking up figures is because I'm really working hard on my top 10 figures of 2017. I really did want to do a top 10 figures last year, unfortunately. I did find out that the Kmart I was working at was cl shutting its doors and that did lead me to a little bit of a depression and that's why I actually stopped doing videos for about a month. If you go back and look at my videos from December of last year to January, I really didn't upload anything because I was really depressed. But I am going to do a top 10 figures of this year now. Hopefully you guys enjoy the figures that I put up there. And I am considering doing subcategories as well, like a top 10 DC figures, top 10 Marvel, top 10 Star Wars, top 10 whatever. If I collect it and I have enough to make a top list, I'll definitely do it. And don't be discouraged if you don't see a figure that you field deserves to be on my top 10 figures because maybe it isn't a subcategory if you don't see a certain multiverse figure in my overall top 10 figures list maybe it's in the multiverse category who knows I still have to go through about uh, 200 250 videos just this year alone so there is that so it is taking me quite a while to find all the videos all the figures that I really want to do I'm even considering doing a top 10 most disappointing figures. However, if it comes down to it, I will just have to rely on stock footage of the figures because a lot of the disappointing figures that I would put on the list, I probably don't even own anymore. I either returned them a few days later or I sold them to get my money back. It's just heads or tails at this point, guys. So if you don't see something... Uh, just know that either I didn't collect enough of it or I just didn't have the time to do it But I really do want to do a top 10 figures of 2017 and that'll probably be up on Friday of next week So be looking forward to that as always guys hope you guys enjoyed this video I do have a couple things coming at you in the future So be on the lookout for that be on the lookout for my top 10 figures of 2017 because that list is coming out like I said next Friday as well as my other top 10 DC, top maybe 5 Marvel, top 10 WWE figures. Whatever else I can make a list for you guys, I will. Don't fret. I'll definitely try to cater to all my viewers. With that being said, guys, I'm King of Dragons 5000. Hope you found this video informative. Hope you're excited for the new year like I am. And as always, if there's a figure you would like to see me review, let me know down in the comments. And I'll do my best to add it to my collection if it fits. If it doesn't, I'm so sorry, guys. I try to just stick with figures that interest me and toy lines that I collect. So, as always, if you don't, if I don't review it, it's not that I'm ignoring you guys. I just don't have room for it in my collection. But until next time, I'm King of Dragons 5000, and I'll see you guys later. Take care, everyone.